Hi. <laughs> so this is the story of um, our move across the country to Chicago. I'm really excited to tell all of you guys this. Um, it starts actually way early. Um, so in May 2021, we started our apartment hunting journey. We flew out to Chicago early May to start looking for apartments because we knew Mac was going to be working out here um, and that we wanted to be close to the city. So I will show that journey of apartment hunting. <laughs> Yeah, we have like six apartments we're viewing today. Yeah, I think so. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> um, Max has been awesome. He's like the one who's really been finding and working with all of these guys. Hopefully you like them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so anyway, we will show you all of the apartments. Yeah, so yeah. All right, so this first apartment building that um, we saw was really nice. It was in an older building um, that had some real charm, which I really liked, um, but it was just a bit too old. If I remember correctly, the AC, we'd have to get our own AC um, and there were some other things, so it wasn't really the apartment for us. The second apartment, the tenant was in the process of moving out, which is why there's so many boxes there, um, but we really honestly liked the apartment um i think the main thing was just the location was a little too close to the city for us the last apartment was amazing um but i'll let past me tell you exactly what happened all right so i want to talk about what just happened <laughs> oh my gosh so i don't know what happened but like we were gonna see like I don't like five to seven apartments today and all of them got changed to only cats allowed online which was really unfortunate and basically narrowed down our options a ton um which was really sad <laughs> but like it was kind of frustrating because the tenant that we were, the, excuse me, the apartment broker we were working out made us feel like really dumb. Like, why didn't you check that the apartments were uh, dog friendly? And we're like, we did. They were all dog friendly before we flew out here. Every single one of them said dogs were okay. Small dogs were okay, which our golden is gonna be, it's a mini golden doodle. So I don't know. It was just ridiculous and it made us feel really stupid and I think, long story short, just work with the building owners. Don't work with apartment brokers. Like, it's nice that they're free, but the building owners are just, they know the building, they know the area. It's a lot better, so it's kind of where I'm at. Anyway, just wanted to explain. <laughs> Despite the problem that we had, we were able to find an apartment, which I will show you the empty apartment tour um, later in the video. But yeah, so once we got the apartment and everything figured out, we ended up packing. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi. We ended up packing everything into a pod, like in the next week after that. <laughs> the reason why is because, as many of you guys know, we were traveling um, all across several national parks um, throughout the summer and so we decided the best thing for us to do would to be just move out of our old apartment and pack everything up and just travel <laughs> so that's what we did as we speak i'm still working on those videos they'll be slowly coming out um, here and there but um yeah so we traveled a ton and then we officially moved across the country in early August with this little guy. Hi, he's really bitey. Hello. Hi. <laughs> it's officially day one of the move. We got little Milo back there in this crate. We've taken him on a couple trips beforehand to get him used to the crate and we're doing, I know, Bubba. I know, we're gonna start driving again in a minute, I promise. I promise. He likes it more when we're actually driving than when we're just sitting. Um, 
Anyway, so we're gonna start off. We have a couple uh, pit stops planned at dog parks for him so he can get some energy out and to go to the bathroom and everything. But our first stop is to Denver. We're gonna stay at Max aunt's house um so exciting we're really like it's bittersweet we said goodbye to some of our closest friends last night and yeah we're definitely gonna miss our friends here in utah but very excited to kind of start the next chapter in chicago <laughs> i'm a mess right now but we made it, we're in Denver. Woo! <laughs> we're gonna spend the rest of the night just chilling and relaxing because driving just takes a lot, a lot out of you. We drove eight hours today with pit stops for Milo. Um, so we left around eight and got here around seven, I think. So like 11 hours. Um, and then tomorrow will be a little bit shorter road drive, hopefully. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head to the middle of nowhere in Kansas tomorrow. It's gonna be so fun. <laughs> we're gonna be in like an Airbnb somewhere. So we will see you guys tomorrow. It's kind of windy. This is day two of our drive. To be honest, I wasn't gonna record a lot of today because um, we're driving through Kansas and it is just farmland pretty much is, it's probably one of the most boring drives I've ever done, to be honest. <laughs> but, no offense if you live in Kansas. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure Kansas is great and it has some cute things, but the drive right now is really, really boring. And we've been stopping at dog parks and randomly this dog park has a giant painting just there. Um, I, it was the most random thing. I was like, what the heck is that? And then it ended up being right next to the dog park. My was just chilling right there. So, super random. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Just a giant, like, painting. So there you go. Um, but we're gonna head to our Airbnb. Probably not gonna film a lot, to be honest, because again, it's just a really boring drive. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're gonna drive out there, chill the rest of the night and then tomorrow we'll be at my family's house which will be awesome so super fun anyway yep Kansas everybody <laughs> St. Louis was super fun. It was nice to see my family and kind of hang out for a minute. But we are officially in our new apartment. Yay! <laughs> we just got here last night. Um, and I wanted to show you guys the apartment that we're going to be living in for the next like three years, which will be crazy. Milo's already happy to be out of the car and done with moving. Um, but yeah, it's a one bedroom apartment. Um, it's a little bigger than our last one, which is really, really nice. Um, it has some really nice features that I'm excited about. So let's take you on the apartment tour. All right, so you walk in, you have a little entry with the bar, um, but what's really, really nice is we have this living room space. <laughs> with a nice little bay window type area. I'm thinking of making this kind of like a seating area um, and we'll set up our TV and have this be like a big gallery wall. Um, if you come over here, we have all of our stuff from like moving. <laughs> if you come over here, we have a kitchen, which is literally, I think three times the size of our last kitchen. I'm so excited about it. All right, so if you come in here, we have a nice little bathroom. Hello. <laughs> um, just super ni nice, way nicer than the last apartment. And then we have our bedroom. It has some nice closet, really, really high ceilings. Um, the only thing is it only has this one window, but I'm gonna try to find some natural light options. So if you guys have any 
things down below that you want to mention, just leave it in the comments. But yeah, that's kind of the apartment. There's like a pantry, I don't know. Just lots of things that I just, we didn't have in our last apartment that I'm really excited about. One thing that I forgot to mention is that we have a porch. Um, but now we've lived here for about three weeks. Um, we've made a couple of friends um, and we've got some things kind of put up together. Um, I will be making some apartment update videos um, when we really start doing some of the home decor, especially in September, um, because we're gonna be changing the kitchen, this wall might get painted, there's gonna be a lot of fun things happening, so I'm really excited to show you guys that. We'll be thrifting for some new furniture, all the things. So I'm really excited to bring you guys along for that transformation. Um, but for now, we're in Chicago, and I can't wait to get—I can't wait to show you guys more of just our lives here. Um, Milo's just munching back there. I'm sure you can hear that. <laughs> um, yeah, and if you want to see more daily things, because obviously YouTube's just been a little slow for me during school, um, you can check out my TikTok and make. A lot of daily videos there and my Instagram I'm always posting on my story so if you want to see that definitely check those out um, but otherwise I will see you guys in the next video um, of course I will also be posting those national park videos along with these normal uploads so um, that'll be like Monday Friday there'll be a video every week so keep looking forward to those but otherwise I'm really excited to just share our lives with you guys yay <laughs> all right i love you guys and i'll see you in the next video bye